It was Coach Allen after the big overtime win over Fairmont State. Rowdy crowd, revenge game. Coach, just overall thoughts. Yeah, it's, uh, told these guys before the game, like this is everything you want as an athlete and as a competitive person. You know, the, you know, the so-called revenge game, a team that embarrassed us on their home floor about a month ago and um, a chance to lock up the league title. Um, what more could you want as an athlete? And, and I thought our guys really battled. Like things weren't looking good and we weren't playing that well down the stretch and we just found a way. And I think good teams find a way to win and we've done that. and. Um, we've won the league again, and it's, it's a credit to you know, the 14 players on the team and, and, and our coaching staff who, who work nonstop and um, you know, all the support staff we have here at West Liberty. It's, it's really fun to be rewarded with the championship um, after you put in a ton of hard work. Take me through the end of regulation. We trailed by, was it five, I think, at least, late? Um, yeah. yeah. And just battling back. Trailed by five, and I believe Bryce hit a – no, Malik hit a pretty big three to cut at the two, and um, you know they got the ball, the inbounds there, and um, we got a we forced a turnover, and then I think uh, we got fouled the next possession, and made one to tie it, I believe. Yeah. Um, and just you know, I thought you know over overtime was really we played it very well, and, and you know we made our free throws. We were 32 of 35 for the game, which is incredible, and. Um, I thought offensively we played really well, um, you know, especially in the first half. We were scoring at an in incredibly high level. And, um, you know, second half, credit Fairmont. I thought they did a really good job defensively. And um, we had a really hard time getting stops in the second half. Was even contemplating throwing in some zone there a little bit, maybe just throw something in different. But um, we got stops when we needed to. And, again, just super proud of these guys. Take me through your message to the team after regulations. I mean, a lot of emotions going through there. It's had a chance to win it at the free throw line. Um, but then you have five more minutes to play. Yeah, it's it's West Liberty Fairmont, right? This is this is what you expect. It's going to be really really tough to win, and um, you know our guys were they were geeked up to be to be tied. You know we snuck one out, and um, you know in overtime I thought we executed really well. We got stops and, and knocked down the free throws when we needed to. And especially with Bryce being fouled out, uh, talk about that team effort. Yeah, well first off, Bryce I thought was incredible today. We we're yeah. really really good, and was at played at an extremely high level, and then. When he fouled out, um, there was no panic, no panic from our team. And, and you know, in practice, sometimes we take Bryce out and, and just kind of have the other guys figure it out. And I thought they did a really good job. And the really cool part about that was, you know, I looked down the bench when, when we were making a run, and the one guy that was cheering the hardest was Bryce Butler. That was really, really cool to see. The environment today? Fun. Yeah, I did, that was, I expected that. Like, <laughs> that, was, that was a lot of fun. And um, I think the, the fans got their money's worth. Um, and, you know, there's a good chance we might see these guys again at some point later in the season. And then just touch back on this clinch in the regular season conference, six straight. You've won nine out of ten, I believe, in the MEC history. Mm -hmm. It's uh, a lot of good players. We've had a lot of good players, and, and um, I have really good assistant coaches. And, and you, know, you put the two together, and you're going to have a good team, and we have a good team. And, um you know, I hope I hope we're not done. But that's the thing, that, and that's what's hard about coaching is we still have two regular season games left. And, and you know, we go to Notre Dame, who's you know been a really tough game for us, especially at their place. And then we got Wheeling, who already beat us this season. So we'll feel good tonight, and um, you know, give these guys off tomorrow and come back to work on Monday. All right, congrats on the win, coach. Thank you.